peace to Kansas City amid the violence. Tibetan monks have made their first stop here as they begin their first North American tour in five years. They're building a sand mandala for world peace at the Temple Buddhist Center on the Country Club Plaza. And KNBC 9's Brian Johnson joins us live with the hope that they offer our metro area. Brian? They do, Lara. Yes, the Temple Buddhist Center is inside the Unity Temple here on the Country Club Plaza. This flyer shows that they have events all week, Wednesday through Saturday morning, where they will be painting with art night and day that could potentially meet your schedule. If you want to go check it out, it's part of their 2023 Sacred Art Tour. This is a prayer from people half a world away. The chant is a blessing for harmony. Peaceful is very important. Seven monks from the Drepango Mang Monastery of South India build a San Mandala. It's a visual prayer. It is so amazing to be a host for something of this magnitude. Each grain of sand falls like a tear from those injured by violence. The monks promote unity, nonviolence, and compassion. Kansas City has seen too much violence. It's one of the worst years for homicides, and the Metro recently lost another officer in the line of duty. It seems like the world is very much at odds. There's so many negative things going on. And so in this practice, it's uh, if you stop the wars inside, you stop the wars outside. When the monks finish, this sand painting will be five feet across. With how many grains of sand? I don't know. I don't know idea what this a million, million sand, yeah. And it's very different color. It could look like this, with symbols of 12 different religions. The colors represent earth, fire, water, wood, and wind. Come and experience this and share this. Find that balance and that open heart within yourself so that you can then share that with others. On the plaza, Brian Johnson, KMBC 9 News. It's absolutely gorgeous. Saturday morning is the disillusion ceremony. Monks in full robes and chants will transport the sand to Brush Creek, where it will be released into the water. For a complete list of their schedule, go to KMBC.com.